Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys as always. And today we have another episode of Clashing Culture. But today is going to be a little bit different. We are in fact going to be Clashing YouTube. That's right guys. We are going to be, like I just said, Clashing YouTube. First we're going to bring in our good old king right here. And uh, <laughs> we're going to have a lot of fun today, alright? We are going to be Clashing none other than... That's right, Landon from Noteworthy Games. Uh, I talked to him the other day and I was like, dude, I really want to turn you into a character from the game. So here it is. This is what we're doing with it. Um, I'm trying to I'm trying to make this happen with other YouTubers as well. Uh, I talked to Godson. I'm uh, talking to Pat right now and just trying to figure out some funny stuff because really this is a lot of fun. It's hilarious. Um, I really, really enjoy it. So... Why don't we go ahead and uh, cut out his cut out his face right here? Um, oops! Stop it! Well, what's going on? <laughs> All right. Well, that's not what we wanted. <laughs> All right. So we're gonna go ahead and cut out his face. I need to get. Uh, All right. So that's right there. And um, but yeah. So what I'm going to be doing? Obviously, I talked to him, and he was like, he first he has to be a barbarian. And we tried that, and it looked okay. Um, I just did a little test run on it. But honestly, I think the Barbarian King fits him uh, a little bit better. You know, hashtag can't be tamed, right? So uh, this is what we are doing for this one. Uh, I think it's going to look really good. I want you guys to keep commenting down below um, what you want from this Clash and Culture series because I love it. It's hilarious. If you guys don't know, I'm a graphic designer for my job. Um, <laughs> Most of the time at work, though, I spend a lot longer than 10 minutes on a project like I am here. Uh, I just try and get these out in a matter of time so that uh, it's not too long for you guys to watch. But all we're doing right now is going through here and uh, cleaning them up a little bit, getting rid of all this extra stuff around his hair. Look at him, just <laughs> staring off into the distance. Landon's got a little model pose going on or something. Um... So, all right, we're looking good with this. Let's bring in his ears a little bit right there. Good, good. All right, and now we need to go and get rid of uh, the majority of the king's head. So first, let's go ahead, and we're going to need to keep the crown, obviously, because Landon's going to need a crown on, right? Because, again, he can't be tamed. <laughs> so let's go through this, and um, we're going to go ahead and get rid of his head real quick, just minimize that. Um, and then let's see what we can do with this. I almost want to <clears throat> try and just brush this skin color right here because we're going to be putting his head on there. So we don't want um, we don't want any of that extra stuff to shine through. Let's go ahead and brush this all the way up here. Yep. Bring in this as well and brush along this inner side. Obviously, it's not going to look perfect, but hey, we're doing what we can. Um, so there is that little strap right there, and then let's try and uh, let's try and make his the skin tone match a little bit better. Uh, there we go. And I'm going to cut out uh, the crown right here. Let's go ahead and copy that, and then on here we will just uh, wait. What did I just do? This needs to be there. Um, what is happening? <laughs> Alright, so I need to... Uh, sorry, I was messing up. Because I'm a noob. We need to cut this out again. Um, and this way, since the crown is on its own uh, layer, we can put it on top, of, on top of Landon's head. Come up in here, get rid of this. Why is that not working? Is that on the bottom one too? Yeah. Get rid of his hair, and then we're gonna have to put Landon's hair up in here as well. Um, this is gonna be really, really funny. <laughs> I promise you, you guys are gonna love it. I always do little test runs, like really quick, just to see if it'll work before I actually go in and do all the details. And <clears throat> this one was cracking me up. <laughs> it's gonna look so good. Um, so, all right, all this is gone. This little part right here. There we go. And zoom back out. And let's go ahead and bring Landon back into the picture. 
we are going to put oops <clears throat> we're gonna put him underneath the crown obviously and just put put his head right here <laughs> I love it it's it already looks so good uh, put him right here let's rotate this a little bit there we go King Landon has arrived to the castle <laughs> I right, put him underneath here uh, and then obviously we're gonna have to match skin tones and whatnot uh, let's go in here and remove uh, the Barbarian King's shoulder right here. Uh, it just doesn't look that good. And uh, come back up behind there. There we go. Good, good, good. Remove this as well. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so you can see it's already taken shape and it looks hilarious. Um, <laughs> let's go ahead and do some work on uh, the actual picture of Landon, we need to um, we need to brighten it up some. Yep, throw in some contrast. There we go. We also need to try and transfer his neck um, into this skin a little bit better. So we are going to oops, we are going to just try and fade this a little bit. Um, but you also the neck also has to be pretty distinct because honestly, I mean, if you look at my neck, you can kind of see how it goes in here so we're gonna need to add a hue and saturation layer on top of this we're gonna need to colorize it and we're gonna need to mess with this until we think that the skin tone uh, is pretty close to matching there we go and then we need to go through okay whatever then we need to go through some of these blending modes and try and get it to fit perfectly you might do this one at like 50% or so. Um, and then we also need to lighten up uh, his face some. So let's put that down to about like right there. Good. And then we need to come up in is it this one. Come up in here and make sure we can see his eyes. There we go. I know. I know the skin tone's still off. We're going to make it work. Um, and then let's come up in here and try and work on the king a little bit um, and let's try and lighten up uh, here let's shoot let's put this up here there we go um, <clears throat> so we're gonna try and match these tones as closely as we can um, whoa what the what just happened that's not what we want. All right, we stop it. Why are you freaking out there? Oh my gosh! All right, we're just gonna delete that and we're gonna do that little portion over. <laughs> all right, so we gotta try and lighten all of this up, um, his skin and everything to match, at least around the neck. Um, yeah. And then we'll brush away the rest of his body so that the rest of his body can stay uh, dark and whatnot. We'll just try and keep it like this around uh, around his neck. And then come in here. It's always it's always hard getting these details down perfectly to uh, fade stuff in. Um, we'll probably need to come up in here and uh, burn this a little bit. Why can't I? Something, something's off on this. Get out of here. <laughs> I need to make sure that this isn't on index. It's not on index, so I don't know why I can't edit this like I want to. Um, I, that just messed things up. Oh, that's all I need to do. Okay, there we go. Um, <laughs> it looks so good already. I just have to figure out his neck right here. Um, Let's go ahead and go, let's copy some of his skin from his neck, this whole little area right here. Let's just copy this. There we go. Um, and let's erase. We're going to erase some of it. And then let's try and paste this around, um, around the barbarian's upper body. So, yeah, that's right there. We're going to put this right here as well. Wow, that just made things look crazy. Um, 
gonna bring it down underneath here nope underneath here what why is all this messing up there stop it what are you doing oh it's all inside of there okay I figured it out <laughs> whenever I moved that it messed up all these I got it okay sweet there we go um, so we're gonna put this one right down here and lock oops and lock that inside as well and just move move his skin around we need to I almost want to get rid of that let's put this up here there we go and then we need to lighten up his skin right here I think we also need to um, come on where are we at human saturation there we go uh, let's try and colorize his skin a little bit to match uh, his neck right there we're getting pretty close there and we're just gonna duplicate his skin right here all over the barbarians uh, all over the barbarians chest bring it up in here as well and obviously there could be better ways to do this but um, I'm just trying to take his skin tone and put it all over uh, this just to make it look a little bit better like it matches. And we're going to hook all of these together. There we go. And let's go through some blending modes and see uh, how it looks. I almost think that I need to, need to darken it up some. And we need to as well take some of it from over there you guys hear that burp <laughs> now it just looks like he's got a freaking hairy chest I'm gonna dodge this um, I don't know why it's using that brush it's kind of annoying I think we need to desaturate it too with the sponge tool nope that's not working we're just gonna get rid of that and we're gonna go back to how it was alright we're at 12 minutes now and obviously I'm not doing too good so uh, <laughs> oops so we just need to figure out this little transfer right here between his neck um, let's grab all of this and why don't we just bring his bring it down some to like right here is his crown really still on there I thought I got rid of that alright so we're gonna bring his head and his neck down some <clears throat> and let's turn it a little bit again just to fit it in here um, there we go and uh, maybe if we throw in a shadow or something right along the neckline like this go through some of these see if we can make it look any better um, come on give me something And let's erase some of this and then really get it to the point to where it looks like uh, there's a little shadow underneath his his neck right there or his chin there um, and I think that we are going to be pretty close to being done right here um, let's throw a blending mode over top of the whole thing or gradient map um, and we should be able to get a good consistent color from it um, okay stop it <laughs> yeah yeah let's do one like this let's put that down to 50 there we go and then let's come up in here and uh, what do we want to do if you guys just hear that that was my cat <laughs> um, all right so what do I want to do to his face in this? We're gonna come up in here. We're gonna go to 50%. Stop, do what I'm telling you to. And then we're gonna go and we're going to draw on land and make him a little bit more visible. Oops, as you can see right there, yep. And then why don't we add one more, uh, one more little blending mode thing on top of this. Let's grab a blue 
let's fill this in and let's go through these and see what kind of look we can get oh gosh <laughs> All right, so blue is not a good color for it. We're just going to grab an orange. That one looks kind of cool, yeah? And let's erase some of it. There we go. And you know, I think we're going to I think we're going to call it there. We're at about 15 minutes, guys. And uh, this is the Landon King, um, Barbarian Landon, whatever you want to call it. Let's make his head a little bit bigger. <laughs> I think that that just solved all of our problems. <laughs> this looks awesome. Okay, so there we have it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you all enjoyed. Um, uh, we will leave this up to Landon if he wants this to be uh, downloadable or whatever. Uh, I'll just I'll let him know about it and I will I will put a link in the video um, for you guys to download stuff so there we have it guys thank you so much for watching this is the Landon King uh, and that's gonna be it as always guys make sure you keep calm and clash on for me right see you guys later